So let's have a look at the, the strange little guitar solo from uh, Devil's Dance. Uh, this is in D standard tuning, so all the strings are down one whole step. So here is a D. And now um, the first like four bars, almost four bars, uh, basically you're gonna do like a very quick tapping here. Not tappy, but like pull off camera on 12th fret on G string, right? And tap pulling off to open G string, right? Uh, at the second beat in the second bar, you will start to dive with the whammy bar, like gradually, slowly diving. Okay, so if you can count in your head, second beat in the second bar, start lowering the whammy bar. And basically you keep tapping like this for three bars. Okay, so one, two, three, four, one, two, then you start lowering the one bar, and three, four, then one, two, three, four, and then one. And second beat in the uh, fourth bar, you just play open. I think it's playing open D and G strings and lower the whammy bar and that's gonna be two beats on that and at the fourth beat <laughs> uh, he's doing some kind of a pitch raising pedal effect I don't know what it is actually uh, I don't have that effect anyway so I basically do uh, I hit the harmonics here on the 17th fret and then I push my warp pedal and down and up. So it's kind of I'm getting kind of like this sound. Okay, <laughs> that's what I'm doing anyway. Um, trying to emulate the the effect that he has. Um, okay, so uh, so you're gonna do this just little wah effect for two beats, and then you're gonna have the other lick. So basically a unison bends on uh, 12 on E and 15 on B, that's bent full step and 3 times on that, in that rhythm. Uh, after that, again, this uh, pitch raising effect that I'm emulating by doing harmonics and wah pedal pushing down and up. So one beat of that, and then again that... Uh, uh, that lick, and uh, then you're gonna have uh, one beat each of this effect and uh, unison bend, so kind of like this. Uh, sometimes I miss that, sorry, but yeah, it's like something like that, okay? I mean, I'm just trying to emulate that <laughs> and have fun in the process. And the final bar, uh, one bit on that, and then you're gonna have this uh, unison bend lick again. Okay, so um, I don't know. Uh, uh, I could play it, play through this uh, without uh, any talking. So one, two, three, four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one, and then a little. 
Okay, it's kind of like that. <laughs> and if you have uh, this, you know, pitch raising effect pedal, whatever he is using, um, that's even better. Use it if you can. Um, so it's, yeah, it's a kind of a crazy guitar solo. It's hard to emulate like perfectly everything, but try to have fun with it rather than trying to copy everything. I think that's the best approach to it. Um, then here on the second slide, uh, you have something like that, right? So, uh, and it's not too complicated. Maybe I can play it a little slower with counting. One, two, three, four. something like that. <laughs> um, if you have any doubts, uh, so what we're doing there basically in the first bar, you play 14-14 on G and B, it's like slightly bent downwards, kind of like that, okay, bend the strings downwards a bit. In the second bar you also have this double stop that you're gonna bend downwards. Then in the third bar, um, again with this double stop on 14th fret, and you're gonna quickly bend and release like this. Okay, and that's for three beats on that, so. Then in the second line, um, so here I think he's doing like a unison bend, uh, but only at the very end of that lick. And so first he's gonna pick 14 on G and 12 on B, and you're gonna like gradually bend the G string to the full step bend in the first beat in the second bar. Okay, so uh, and you're gonna pick those notes as 16 notes. So like. Okay, so something like that, right? So it's going on for like five beats in total, this unison bend lick, uh, or gradual unison bend lick, maybe you should call it. And then you have this. That ending in the second bar. Then in the third bar, again, we have this 14th, 14th um, double stop, gradual bend over three beats. And you, you're gonna hold that uh, shape for two bars basically. So gradual bend for three beats, okay? And then you're gonna hold it and at the fourth beat uh, he's gonna start to do this like very gentle whammy bar uh, uh, tapping you know, and releasing kind of, kind of like this. Okay? And yeah, that will be pretty much it. So <laughs> a lot of you know, whammy bar and effects and stuff going on in this solo. Uh, I tried to replicate it as best as I can and uh, I hope that makes sense. So have fun with that. See you later.